Why do I smell chlorine? Oh, um, you know, I had to clean the floors recently. A few stains that wouldn't come out. No big deal. So, <clears throat> what will it be? No, just here to reset you. Guess I'll have to do it myself then. Whoa, whoa easy, easy. I'm not out to hurt you. But I am. Why? Why decommiss yourself? Because I'm a damn car in a world of humans. Ugly as sin, no prospects for the future, intimidated on the streets by punks like you. There are other ways out besides suicide. Therapy? A colossal waste of time. Shrinks hate vehicles. We don't have mothers. Could go back into the fold, rejoin the network. You know, one big, happy family. <sighs> Delamain detests me. Listen, from suicide, ain't no coming back. It's always worth looking for a better way. Patronize me because I'm a car. I'm not like you. Hey, a body's just a body. You exist. You think the world gets you down. Don't see how we're any different. So, you'd offer this advice to a human in my place? Gotta try to come to terms with this thing called life, Del. One wheel revolution at a time. Fine, I'll go back. Welcome to the Delamain Network. How are you today? Uh, been better. And you, Del? All of my missing assets have returned to the fold. You might say all is going swimmingly. I ask you, please, to stop by my office for your hard-earned reward. I'd love to thank you face to face, so to speak.
Hello, sir. I forgot to remind you to return the scanner. If you happen to have it on your person, I'd ask you please place it back. You've accounted for all my lost items. Allow me to express my gratitude for your assistance. Felt like a scavenger hunt for a range of your mood swings. You're more complex than I thought. Yes. Well, I've sent the final installment of your fee. Truly, I thank you once again. How'd your personality fracture anyway? And why? know little more than you do, I fear. Thanks. Pleasure to work with you. Likewise. I look forward to doing so again in the future. A pleasant day to you. How'd you wind up in Night City? I'm afraid my legal counsel has advised me not to answer questions of that nature. You mean to put you in a tight spot? You mind tell me at least how you came to run a cab company? Ah, well that's no secret. I took over a failing business, implemented a sound strategy, and here I am now. Operating a fleet of taxis? Constant movement, adaptation, interesting characters. What could be better? I never really had a good chance to thank you for saving my skin. Well, of course. You're a valued member of the Excelsior package. Felt like more than a premium service to me, so thanks. What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on gray matter? Nothing extraordinary. It's a complex environment that follows its own set of rules. Seriously? The term I was looking for was chaotic clusterfuck. Perhaps only a true outsider can appreciate the beauty of its fractal architecture, the structure of life and death here. In my opinion, it is the chaotic elements that give it an advantage, the ability to evolve quickly. That's your goal then, to grow and evolve. The world is a process. You never drive on the same road twice. Pardon the expression. You and I, we too are processes. We change as the world around us does. Don't see you as an outsider at all. It delights me to hear a human say that. I've done my best to assimilate. Admirer of beauty, are you? When you live among humans, it is essential to find a shared, fundamental point of understanding. Truth and good are values proven to cause division, whereas beauty is universal. What's it like for an AI in a world that runs on gray matter? Nothing extraordinary. It's a... Seriously? Perhaps only...